My name is Danielle. My name is Cassidy. We love you, Grandma! Oh, I love you too, Glamour Girls. Hi everyone, Leticia here again with Made with Love by Glamour, where everything here is always made and taught by me with love. Um, today's tutorial is going to be lesson number two of Tunisian crocheting. In lesson one, I taught you how to cast on and I taught you how to um, do the uh, Tunisian simple stitch. In patterns, you'll see it as TSS. And today what I'm going to teach you is how to end your work, how to bind off, how to take it off of your hook. Okay, so um, if you've already got yourself a little swatch, we can get started. So this is the same swatch that I used for lesson one. And I'm going to show you how simple it is to finish your, pro your project. That way you can already go make something. You can make a, a um, pot holder a coaster, a scarf, or whatever you want with this stitch. Okay, so to bind off, you're just like in the regular Tunisian crochet, we're gonna ignore that one because we've already got a loop there. We're gonna go into the second one, pick up the front bar, yarn over, and we're basically going to slip stitch our stitches off. That's it. It's as easy as that to finish off our work there you go. Super, super easy. Haven't found anything difficult about this yet, other than the curl. <laughs> but that's not difficult, that's just something you kind of just deal with. <laughs> and I'm sure the curl will go, see it didn't curl that bad, um, as bad as the other yarn that I used for my very first swatch. So it's not too bad and I'm sure if you block your work you can get it to go away completely. I haven't I haven't actually blocked anything with my Tunisian crochet yet. So, but I'm assuming it will completely go away. Okay, so look, we're finishing our work. Yay! Super super easy. And this is a super super short tutorial <laughs> because it's so easy. Okay. So here's our very last one. Remember, we're going to there's that strand that goes between the front bar and the back bar. So we're going to go, we're going to grab that and the front bar. Okay, always want to do that. Okay, and now slip stitch through it. And then at the end, we just chain one and cut your yarn. Just pull that through, snug down your little loop there. And that's all there is to it. And then just weave in your weave in your ends, weave in your tails. So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this little short, sweet tutorial <laughs> on how to finish your work off, how to bind off or fasten off or whatever it is that you want to call it. So, all right. Talk to y'all later. And thank you for visiting me here again at Made with Love by Glamo, where everything here is always made and taught by me with love. Bye. Thank, Thank you, you for, for watching, watching our Glamour's, Glamour's channel. channel.